special of Miki is that it's the only restaurant in the island who sits on the sand. You know, when you see, sometimes, you know, we get used to this beauty and we don't appreciate it. So, but sometimes when you come and you see somebody with his mouth open watching this beautiful paradise, that if anybody coming from Boston or New York or any other big cement city would not even imagine that it's existing. Well, I was born and raised in Italy. It was about 12 years ago. I moved to Bermuda. Well, first arrived here, it was, uh, uh, as I say, it was, everything was different. As I said, and I found all this fresh, beautiful seafood, uh, lots of fish, and uh, as I said, different spices. You know, and I try, even myself, try you know, new dishes, as a new flavors, you know, a new kind of combination, try to uh, put ingredients together and at the beginning it was a good challenge and uh, I really enjoyed it. It was, it was, it was fine, it was nice. We use uh, the best ingredient on the market, uh, fresh ingredients, uh, the, uh, the cigarette. We use in very, very simple way to cook. You know, we don't uh, work too much on the food, we don't elaborate the food too much. It's, it's simple but it's, uh, it's, it's great, it's fresh. What I would like to show you now are the two most popular dishes that we have on the lunch menu. Starting here with the local pink swordfish carpaccio that is served under a crunchy vegetable salad and it's seasoned with chives and red peppercorn, of course, extra virgin olive oil and fresh lemon. The other dish that's very popular at Mickey's is this beautiful chicken and mango salad with fresh fruit. This dish is on the menu since the first day we opened the restaurant. A full meal, but at the same time are light and uh, tasteful. Well, going on the pasta side, we have this uh, beautiful Paccheri di Gragnano. It's this large pasta coming from South Italy. It is served with uh, fresh yellowfin tuna, zucchini and, um, and clams. This big pasta, you can see, it's called Paccheri di Gragnano, but coming from Puglia. It's one of the best pasta in Italy. I love it. It's, uh, it's simple, but it's colorful, tasteful, it's full of flavor, it's fantastic. This is a called uh, Mickey's uh, Seafood and Self uh, Selfish Meat Grill, and uh, it's our signature dish on the dinner menu. And uh, you can see it's a beautiful selection of grilled uh, seafood. And it's simple, but you know, it, you can see it's reflecting our cuisine. And of course, with this uh, seafood, you need a little bit of white wine. So, salute. Now I have to go back to the kitchen. I've been in the uh, restaurant industry in the island for the last 40 years. So I've been down here for the last 17 years. And actually we built Mickey's first time in uh, 1995. Since then we lost it three times due to a big storm. And the last time was in 2004 when Fabian struck Bermuda. The place was completely broke down. So we had to rebuild it in the fashion you see today. But you know, I think for me it's like going back home in Italy. It's a beautiful uh, beach place which brings in an experience that many people, they don't live every day wherever they come from. We have a, a cooking style that you know, you can make any gourmet restaurant be uh, uh, concerned about. But at the same time, we have a friendly service that make people come back over and over again. It's a place you come at night time and you feel romantic, you walk on the beach uh, or you stroll in the, uh, with your family and uh, the children run on the sand and play and you can have like, a casual dinner. And uh, like tonight we have the top politician on the island coming in for a special event and we're ready to provide them the best service we can offer. That's the quality of the Mickey's and it's a passion on our side to make people happy.